What's up YouTube? Today we're going to go ahead and talk about a piece of software that you can definitely go ahead and update all of your Windows drivers and you can do this with the online version as well as offline. Okay, so that's very, very important to go ahead and have all of your Windows up to date. That way you can get the most out of your computer. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started and I'll show you the way you can do that. Right after you go ahead and open up your web browser, you, you're going to want to go ahead and Google this right here. Go ahead and Google driver pack solution. Okay. Go ahead and Google that right there, driver pack solution, and it's going to go ahead and take you into this page right here, okay? So I wanted to go ahead and show you a little bit about this. Uh, as you can see right here, driver pack, it's suitable for all these brands of computers right there. As you can see, there's a lot of them, and uh, there's a lot more that are not currently on that particular list that uh, will definitely have drivers for, okay? And right here, as you can see, driver pack has all these drivers for your uh, sound car for your graphic car your network Bluetooth uh, for for anything for even for printers for monitors and there's millions and millions of uh, drivers on this particular database all right so let's say if all you want to do is you know update your drivers this is what you're gonna want to go ahead and do right there go ahead and click that right there install all required drivers and as you can see right here on the left hand side it's gonna go ahead and download this installer it's portable okay it's a portable file okay so go ahead and run it the um, installation will be probably about a minute make sure you go ahead and tick that right there where it says run in expert mode because otherwise it's just gonna go ahead and start loading all your drivers but it's definitely good if you want to go ahead and and uh, pick your drivers okay so you definitely want to go ahead and tick that right there where it says run in expert mode okay and I will go ahead and untick that right there where it says voice voice assistant and you know just give it probably about a minute or so it's gonna go ahead and load quickly and you'll be able to go ahead and see the uh, the drivers that are that are currently available for your computer okay this is the way it looks after the uh, portable file has finished loading and scanning your computer as you can see right here uh, the the only thing you do is basically you go ahead and click the uh, little check mark right there and that's pretty much it you know you pick the ones that you want all right and then after that you know just go ahead and click that install whether it's uh, two drivers one driver if you wanted to go ahead and update all of them then just go ahead and click that right there install all whatever number is right there it's, you know right? and um, that's for the uh, online installation okay so just go ahead and click that if you want to go ahead and exit out of that right there now we'll go ahead and go back all right and the way that you can go ahead and load your drivers offline go ahead and go to this option right there where it says for system admins you go ahead and click that option right there and as you can see right here this is the uh, the one that we just did our right? driver pack online this one right here is a driver pack offline for uh, network drivers only, you know, for your Wi-Fi and your LAN drivers. Now, this is right here. This is the bingo right here, okay? This is a large, large file right here. It's 24 gigs, and this is mainly going to be if you're constantly working on computers or if you just want to go ahead and have that right there, okay? Now, this is a 24 gig file, and you definitely want to go ahead and download it. You know make sure you know you give it a little bit of time it'll probably take I don't know depending on your bandwidth speed probably half hour an hour a couple of hours or whatever so go ahead and download that file keep it in a uh, external hard drive and then like after you go ahead and load the operating system for the first time you don't need no internet connection or anything just go ahead and plug your uh, external hard drive into the computer go ahead and execute the file and it's gonna go ahead and start loading all your drivers not a problem at all okay so that's the way that you can go ahead and install your drivers uh, offline okay so that's all you do is go ahead and click the download right after you click the download button right there it's gonna go ahead and download a BitTorrent file okay so make sure you have BitTorrent installed because that's the reason why it's gonna go ahead and download the file via a, a torrent okay because it's a extremely large file it's 24 gigs all right so right after that just go ahead and put that in in uh, a USB or an external hard drive whatever you have and uh, you should be able to have all the database of any kind of driver okay so we'll go ahead and go back over here 
and right here it also has another option right there so you can go ahead and uh, search for any drivers okay you can put uh, Dell uh, you know you go ahead and put the uh, model number of laptop or computer and it shows you the uh, drivers that you can go ahead and get all right so that's very very complete option right there okay so and right here it has a software search you can go ahead and download a couple of uh, free like a web browser when you're our VLC media player whatnot okay so that's gonna be my time for this video I hope this really helps you out and uh, let me know okay please go ahead and like and subscribe and I will see you here shortly in another tutorial okay?